what are the real world applications for all this? That is the million dollar question. Yeah. And I think the most exciting part, this goes way beyond just fixing teeth. Okay, so DPSCs, they're like these microscopic regenerative superheroes, right? Superheroes in the making, definitely. And we're getting closer to figuring out how to guide them, how to use their powers, so to speak. But what does that actually look like? Paint me a picture. Give me some real world examples. Get ready for a wild ride through the human body, DPSC style. That's so ready, hit me. First stop, spinal cord injuries. Okay, yeah. Everyone knows how devastating those can be. Uh, absolutely devastating. Often, permanent paralysis life-changing right because the spinal cord that's like the body's information superhighway damage there it affects everything exactly and this is where those dpscs they offer a real glimmer of hope you know yeah okay i'm seeing the connection to those neural crest cells we talked about they're good at making nerve so exactly they have that potential to actually regenerate that nerve tissue so we could use them to like rebuild those damaged connections you got it researchers are exploring ways to transplant dpscs directly into the injured spinal cord, sometimes using those scaffolds, the growth factors we talked about. To encourage those new connections. Exactly. To encourage new nerve growth, restore function. It's still early, but the potential is there. It's remarkable. So what else? 